Thanks for checking out my system.io tutorial for beginners. In this video, I'm going to walk you through exactly how to set up a simple funnel inside of system.io. We're talking about creating landing pages, connecting it to a thank you page, collecting emails, and setting up basic email automation. If you want to follow along, I'll drop a link in the description and a pinned comment so you can grab your free account. All right, let's jump in. So the first step inside of system.io is to head over to funnels and click create. I'll name my funnel lead generation, but you can name yours whatever makes sense to you. Then we're gonna choose build an audience since we're not selling anything in this example, and then hit save and boom, your funnel is created. Now click on the funnel name to open it and you'll see two steps, a squeeze page where people enter their email and a thank you page where they land afterwards. Now let's pick a template for a squeeze page. When you're just starting out, I like to keep things super simple. One headline, one email box, and a button. That's it. The less clutter, the better these pages usually perform. So let's pick a clean template, then click select, and let's edit it. Inside the editor, delete anything you don't need. Big images, extra sections, random text. Just keep it tight and focused. For the headline, use a simple formula. How to big benefit without painful thing. Here's some examples. How to lose weight without giving up your favorite foods. How to launch an online business without wasting money on ads. And how to start a YouTube channel without ever filming a video. That curiosity factor is what makes people want to opt in. Under the headline, add a short subheadline or call to action. We're going to enter enter your best email below to get the free cheat sheet. Now here's a pro tip, ask only for the email, not the name, not the phone number or anything else. The fewer the hoops, the higher your opt-in rate. Change the button text to something more action oriented like click here to continue or get instant access. Make it stand out. I usually go with the color green because green means go. And that's it for the squeeze page. Hit save and let's move on. The next step is the thank you page. And again, pick a simple template. Delete the extra fluff and keep the message clear. Something like, thanks for signing up. Click below to download your free gift. We're gonna drag in a button and change the text to something like, click here to download your free guide. Then link it to your PDF or your video or whatever freebie it is that you're giving away. Now this is where most people stop, but here's the real gem. Use your thank you page as prime real estate. Somebody just gave you their email address. So that means they're interested and they're paying attention. So right below your free download, add a next step offer. For example, if your freebie is about YouTube, link them to a tool or a course that helps them grow faster. If it's about fitness, maybe promote a related product or a program. That way, you're not just collecting leads, but you're setting yourself up to earn money right away. Now we get to the fun part. We got our squeeze page, we've got our thank you page. So this is what happens next. When someone enters their email, you collect it, and then you can send them emails automatically. So let's walk through how to set that up. Inside your account, go to emails, then click campaigns. If this is a brand new account, you want to create a new campaign. And quick note before we do this, you will need to use your own domain email address. You cannot use Gmail or Yahoo. So when you create your campaign, just give it a name that makes sense. Something like affiliate campaign or software campaign. This is just for your reference. Now, when you're setting this up, it's gonna ask you for your sender email address. That needs to be tied to your domain. If you don't have that set up yet, let's talk about how to do it. Click on your profile picture, go to settings, and then click on emails. There are two things that are gonna need to happen here. First, you need to verify your email address. So what you'll do is, is add your email that's tied to your domain. The system's gonna send you a confirmation email. You'll open it up, click the link, and then you'll be verified. The second thing is you need to authenticate your domain. This is gonna add your domain info into the email header. And this matters because it'll boost your email delivery rate and make sure your emails actually land inside inboxes. Now this step takes a little longer because there's usually a delay when the records are updated. 
you'll get the DNS records you need to add to wherever your domain is hosted. For me, my domain is on Namecheap, but if you're using GoDaddy or another provider, the interface will look different. So inside your settings, click the little eyeball, and it'll show you the exact records you need to add. So just copy those into your domain's DNS settings, give it a little time, and you'll be good. If you run into issues, you can always reach out to System IO support. They'll walk you through all of it. Once you've verified your email and authenticated your domain, you're ready to roll. Now go to campaigns, click into the campaign you just created, and hit create. Here, you're going to add a subject line, your sender name, and your sender email, which should already be filled in. As for the editor, the classic editor works just fine. Now, let's add a subject line. I like to keep this super simple and direct. So, we're going to say something like, click here to download your cheat sheet. It's a clear call to action and a reminder of what they just requested. So, add in your subject line, put in your name, and save it. Here's an example that you can use for your first follow-up email. And this is just an example, so fill in the blanks wherever it makes sense at. But you're going to say, your free resource just landed in your inbox. Think of it like a digital treasure map for your business. Inside, you'll find the exact tools to whatever your benefit is without needing to be a tech wizard or spend a fortune. Then give them the download link. So where are you going to put that at? Instead of linking directly to Dropbox or Google Drive, I recommend sending them back to your thank you page. Why? Because remember, your thank you page is your valuable real estate. On that page, they can grab the resource, but they can also get another chance to, you know, watch your webinar or click on your affiliate link or whatever offer it is that you have in place there. It's just another touch point that can lead to conversions. So grab the link to your thank you page, insert it into the email, and you're good to go. When you're done, save and publish the email. Now you want this email to go out immediately after someone opts in. This is what is called day zero. You want to set it to send right away with no delays. And if you want to build out more emails, you can just keep adding them here. For example, you got day one email, day three email, day five email, and so on. This is how you build up a full follow up sequence. Now let's link this campaign to your funnel. Go back to your funnel, then click on your squeeze page, and then click on edit page. Then you're going to want to go ahead and click on your opt-in button. And by default, it submits the form and takes them to the thank you page. Now we want to add an automation rule. So you're going to go choose add action and then subscribe to campaign. Select the campaign you just created, save the rule, and that's it. From now on, whenever someone opts in, they'll get added to your email campaign automatically. All right, so to recap, you got your squeeze page and your thank you page. You set up your email campaign and verified your domain. You wrote your first automated email with a clear call to action. You linked it back to your thank you page for more conversions, and you connected everything to your funnel with automation rules. Now, every time someone opts in, the system takes over. You're building your list, you're following up automatically, and you're creating leverage in your business. If this was helpful, hit that like button, subscribe for more tutorials, and check the link below to get your free System.io account. I'll see you in the next video.